I'm Tatum Skipper and welcome to Jackson County Today. Jackson County has a lot to offer. Let's take a look. Welcome back. We are just having way too much fun here this afternoon. Here for the inaugural Mistletoe Market here in Mariana. Here now with Amanda. Amanda, are you a vendor? I am not. I'm a volunteer. Ah, okay, for, for, Co uh, for Covenant Hospice. I'm volunteering for Covenant today, but I work okay. for Suncrest Omni Home Health Care. Okay. Covenant, just a wonderful organization. Uh, just a lot of good quality people. Huge number of volunteers. Yes. Do you have any, have any idea how many volunteers they work out of this office? I actually don't. It's hundreds. Yeah, a lot. Yeah, uh, uh, more than I would have imagined. Right. Um, we had the fortune of working with them with the Garden Gala right. uh, this summer. Were you there? I was not there this year, but I was there last year. Okay. <laughs> um, that event has just exploded. It has. It sells out. It does. As I tell Jennifer, all they can do now is raise the price of the tickets, and she's kind of remiss to do that. So I understand that aspect of it. But when you're so sold out, you can't pack any more people in and you want to make more money, you're going to have That's to just right. raise the price. That's exactly right. Are you having fun here this morning? I'm having a great time today. What are you seeing around here? I'm seeing lots and lots of cute items for sale, lots of happy people, um, lots of customers, and lots of happy vendors as well. Well, for a first-time event, this is a huge success already, it appears. It, has been, it looks like it's a great success, and I'm sure next year it'll be even better. I was talking to Jennifer a while ago, and she said that they had something like 250 people come through this morning. Right. There's been a lot of people. And Friday, obviously, is uh, the toughest sell because it's a work day. People are at work. We came this afternoon because we figured that it's going to start getting busier as the afternoon winds down. Right. The doctors start getting off for the afternoon, That's that sort right. of thing. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. You know what I'm talking about. I do know what you're talking about. But tomorrow <laughs> appears like it's going to be the big day. I think tomorrow will be because, like you said, it's a weekend, and people will be out and about and, and looking to spend some money. Is it a football day tomorrow? Um, I'm an Auburn fan and we're off. Okay. But I know that... <laughs> so have you called all your Auburn friends to come on out? <laughs> I, did, I better get on that, I guess. <laughs> Facebook has had a huge impact on this event. Uh, there's been a lot of advertising, a lot of promotion done on Facebook. Right. Um, everyone I've spoken to says they've seen it on Facebook. Right. Uh, even the people that aren't on Facebook have told me that. So I think they're lying probably when they <laughs> say that just so. to make me happy. But uh, nonetheless, they've done a great job of promoting and marketing the event. Definitely. Definitely. Have you seen any of the TV commercials or anything? I have. I've okay. actually seen the commercial on Facebook that I guess maybe you guys did for her with right. Jennifer. Right. She did a great job. And I've also seen it on Facebook. I've seen flyers. I know they've done some other community events, passed out some flyers in different places. So they spread the word. Well, Amanda, thanks for being part of this event. Thanks sure. for your hard work for Covenant, and, and thanks for coming over and speaking to us. I know that you were not you were a little bit reluctant <laughs> to get involved, but I think you watched a couple other people and realized no blood was shed and right. nothing really bad happens right. as far as you know. Right, just got That's yeah. right. We're here with Amanda right now for the inaugural Mistletoe Market here at the Ag Center in Mariana, just a short ways off of busy Highway 90 and uh, Interstate 10. If you're anywhere within the sound of my voice, you can get here very quickly. you got all day tomorrow, which is November 23rd. Is that correct? That's correct. And uh, come on out here, bring your checkbook, uh, bring your credit card, and bring that cold, hard cash, and you'll be able to do some of that preliminary Christmas shopping. We'll be right back. Welcome back. Still here at the inaugural Mariana Mistletoe Market. Here now with Mary Margaret Ferris. Yes, sir. Is that correct? Uh, Mary, do you go by Mary, Mary Margaret, or Mary Margaret Ferris, or Miss Ferris, or how would you like me to address you? Mary Margaret. You would. <laughs> Mary Margaret. Okay. Um, we're here at the inaugural event. So obviously it's the first day of a new event. Kind of slow maybe, but how is it going so far for you? It was pretty busy this morning. It's going good. I like it. You making some money? Yes, sir. Making some people happy, more importantly? Yes, sir. Um, Covenant Hospice is a wonderful organization. This is a fundraiser for them. They do two or three in the course of the year. You're aware of that? Yes, sir. Okay. I would think that there are going to be people here as vendors and as attendees who come just to support hospice. Yes, sir. Um, as well as maybe get some good bargains. Do you have any show specials that people could take advantage of uh, versus on a regular day? Um, we have some closeout deals on some Scentsy bars, um, $2 a piece for all the ones that are discontinued. Scentsy bar, is that like a sushi bar? No, not really. You burn okay. it in a warmer. Okay. <laughs> well, we're having a good time so far. Uh, again, the first day of a first-time event, so you never know which way it's going to go. When you're in here, is a Christmas spirit. Everything is decorated Christmas style. We've got Christmas music playing. A little premature. It's not even Thanksgiving <laughs> That's yet. That's very but, true. Uh, my wife is here uh, taking photos on our behalf. I think she's doing more shopping than photographing, <laughs> though, at this point. Uh, Mary Margaret, thank you for um, taking the time to talk to us. You were a little reluctant at first, but as you see... Not so bad. Not so bad. Hopefully you're going to make a lot of money. Uh, would you come back? 
Yes, sir. I'm coming back next year for sure. If you were an attendee, would you be walking around having a good time? Yes, sir. So pretty good measure of the event so far. Yes, sir. Thanks again for being part of the event and thanks for talking to us. You're welcome. Thank you. Here at the inaugural Mariana Mistletoe Market here at the Ag Center on Pennsylvania Avenue in uh, Mariana, just a short ways from I-10 and Highway 90. So wherever you're coming from, very accessible, very easy to get to, and hopefully you're going to join us. We'll be right back. Welcome back. We've been spending a very pleasurable day right here at the Ag Center on Pennsylvania Avenue. Here right down here in downtown Mariana, not far from the interstate for the inaugural Mariana Mistletoe Market. Here right now with Peggy Ann. Uh, you're one of the vendors here today. What is it that you're selling? I'm selling origami owl. They are living lockets that create your own story and tell your story, your personal story. Wow. So this is a form of jewelry. That's correct. That's okay. correct. Necklaces and bracelets. And, and what materials would this be made out of? Uh, they're made out of uh, 9.925 sterling silver overlay. There's 14 karat gold overlay. Uh, we also have the rose gold. Um, so in this day, in this economic time of uh, heartburn maybe, um, mm -hmm. probably a good investment too. That's correct. That's right. We're looking for designers in this area. I'm the only one in this area, so I'd be happy to have some more join my team. And it's very economical to get into the business. It's Cost $149 startup fee. That's it. That so you're already uh, franchising. That's correct. That's correct. Wow. Now, do you um, hand tool all of your own uh, uh, wares, or, or how does that work? No, sir. They are done in Arizona. They are handcrafted, and I order them from the company, okay. and they ship them to me. Okay. Well, um, so far so good as far as uh, sales today. Oh yes, sir. And we've had we've booked quite a few jewelry bars. We also come into your home and oh, set up a jewelry bar. Jewelry bar. Yes. What is a jewelry bar? A jewelry bar is where everything is laid out on a table, and you get to interact with the jewelry, build your own, see what you like, see what you don't like. You pick your uh, style, your own locket, your chain, your. So kind of like a jewelry buffet. That's correct. Okay, that's kind right. of, that's pretty cool. All now, is that a eat. new concept? <laughs> Yes, sir, it is. Okay. Yes, it is. Where are you located? Where is your business physically located? Uh, well, I'm in Mariana, Florida. Okay. It's a home-based business. Okay. And I come to you. I'll come to your office, to your workplace, doctor's office. I'll come into your home, or we do events like this. Wow. Well, I can't imagine anything more convenient. That's correct. Uh, now, do you do any of these ladies' nights out and that sort of thing? It seems Absolutely. like that'd be pretty fertile ground. You get a half a bottle of wine in them, and they're <laughs> going to spend some money with you. That's correct, yes. We do ladies' nights out. We even do couples where they can come and have uh, the football game on during halftime. Then we'll no, I, I don't. Yeah. I don't go yeah. for that one. Everything up to that point was good. I don't see that happening. Well, Peggy Ann, thanks for taking the time to speak with us, and thanks You're for welcome. being more Thank importantly, you. thanks for being part of the show. Thank you. Uh, are you having fun? I'm. I am. At I always end, have fun. Life is fun. At the end of the day, that's really all that matters. That's correct. Here right now with Peggy Ann at the inaugural Mariana Mistletoe Market. Uh, having a good time. We're talking to a lot of folks. It looks like people are having a good time. The vendors seem to be making a little bit of money. The attendees are walking away with shopping bags, so apparently they're either buying something or stealing something, so I'd be getting back to your booth as quickly as I could. But we're going to be here all the rest of the afternoon and maybe have a little more fun, talk to a few more people, and we'll be right back.